All right, TT, first place in the 200 meters. Uh, a great season for you so far, and it continues for you. Take me through the race. I know it's one that you're really happy about. Um, well, with the race, it was uh, at first going to be two-section final. And so it got, uh, I think, three people scratched. So um, then it got moved to one, one section. So for me, that was really good because then it's just like one race, one final. And if you win that, you win the whole thing. And so um, that was good. I know you're really happy with your time. The, the corners on this track a little bit sharper than usual. So to go out, I believe in 2084, I know is something that you're really happy about. What sort of improvements do you want to make as the regular season continues? Only a couple more meets left. Uh, I definitely want to touch up on my speed a little more. Um, I think this, this weekend it was definitely good and my body held up through the rounds. Um, I wish I could have ran that 60. I was very frustrated about the false start, but uh, you know, I just told myself to keep moving forward. I can't really focus on what's past. And so, um, yeah. You mentioned the 60. When you have that disappointment and you end up getting scratched from the final of that one, how do you refocus and pour all your energy into a successful 200? I know it'd probably be easy to, to kind of go into the shell a little bit after that. Yeah, uh, it's something that um, false start, I, I don't really do it often. And so to do it today, it was just, it really caught me off guard and I couldn't really explain what happened. And so I was very uh, frustrated in the beginning, the first 10 minutes, and then, you know, I had to kind of refocus and I just told myself, don't, um, don't focus on the past. We still got the 200 meters uh, to come and that's where my focus should be and it worked out well.